If you don't like overnight oats, make overnight quinoa instead. So start by getting yourself a pretty large jar or bowl and we're gonna add in our cooked quinoa. Now I like to make my quinoa the night before or a few hours earlier just so that it has a chance to become a little bit drier. This will help it to absorb more of the liquid that we're gonna add later. Then we're gonna add some hemp hearts and chia seeds. Both of these are packed full of protein and nutrition plus a little bit of maple syrup for some extra delicious maple -y flavor and sweetness plus some vanilla as well. And then we're gonna add a can of full fat coconut milk. You can totally use just the refrigerated box kind as well and then we're gonna add some sea salt and a little pinch of cinnamon just for extra flavor and then all we gotta do now is mix it up this is going to thicken up a lot overnight but make sure that you stir it really well so that you don't have clumps of chia seeds that get stuck together and don't absorb as well so there you go seal it pop it in the fridge overnight and it's going to turn out looking something like this it's become a lot thicker and creamier i really really like the texture of overnight quinoa it's kind of different from overnight oats i can't really explain it if you're just not a fan of the chewy texture of raw oats then overnight quinoa might be a little bit more of a familiar texture to you and it's just really great I really like it or on the other hand if you're just looking for a way to still make overnight oats if you've run out of oats you can just use quinoa this is a great hack slash substitution for making overnight oats when you don't have oats so moving on you certainly don't have to be as extra as I am right now by arranging my strawberries in this very fancy way but I was just feeling a little bit over the top so here we go I made my strawberry overnight quinoa look very fancy but you don't have to do this and you also certainly don't have to use strawberries if you don't have them strawberries just happens to be my favorite combination with coconut overnight quinoa but this works great with blueberries with raspberries any kind of mixed berries frozen berries heck you can even throw in some banana as well because you know strawberry and banana is a totally epic combination and here you go this is so beautiful isn't this look just so luscious it is very creamy it's got delicious thick creamy texture this is packed full of protein and nutrition from the quinoa the hemp seeds the chia seeds this is absolutely a filling breakfast this keeps me full for at least a few hours up until lunchtime and it's just so good the amount that I made here today will serve at least two to four people so if you're feeding a household this is great but if you also just want a meal prep for yourself for a few days worth of breakfast this is a great way to do it This is so good, you guys. Oh my gosh. Mmm. Strawberries and coconut? Are you kidding me? Mmm.